Welcome to the installation video for Seismix Photon Side View Mirrors. These directions are for SKU 18107 and 08 for 1.75 and 2 inch round cages. If you have 18109 for ProFit cages instead, click on the top right corner for your installation video. This process will take around 30 minutes. First, you want to make sure that you have everything you need to get started. So in the box, you should find two mirrors, two split washers, two round clamps, two clamp caps, six M5 by 16 millimeter bolts, and two M5 by 30 millimeter bolts. You'll also have two shims if you have our 18108 kit. The tools you'll need from your shop are a four millimeter and five millimeter Allen wrench. If you have issues with anything straight out of the box, please contact us at this number and we'll fix you right up. So first, you'll wanna open up your clamp. You might have to take out the socket head bolts to take off the clamp cap and open it up. If you have a 1.875 inch cage, place our shim within the clamp just like this with the ridge side facing inward. Close the clamp onto the cage, then thread an M5 by 30 bolt through this way until it's finger tight. Then thread the inwards pointing bolts so it's not too tight as well. Thread the end of your mirror into the clamp with the split washer. Then move the clamp to where you want the mirror to be and tighten the bolts all the way down when it's to your liking. If you find that your ball joint is too loose or too tight, all you have to do is tighten up the socket head bolts right here with your five millimeter Allen wrench. Make sure you have the correct mirror for each side. The Seismic logo will always be upright. Now repeat this with your remaining mirror to complete your set. If you ever break your mirror glass, the replacement is super easy. You'll start by calling Seismic customer support and they'll get your new glass sent to you in a jiffy. When that's come in, remove the mirror from the clamp and place it face up on a flat and stable surface. Use a T20 Torx driver to unscrew the bezel from the front. Then put that to the side, carefully take out the old glass and replace it with the new glass while making sure that it's flat and centered in the housing. Now replace the bezel and thread the mirror back into your clamp. Boom, new glass. So simple. Now, if anything happens to your mirrors, please let us know because they're backed with our famous unlimited lifetime warranty. We'll fix it for free forever. Have any other questions? Drop us a line sometime. And if you want to stay in the loop with Seismic, make sure to check us out on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Thanks for watching.